All right. Good evening, folks. Welcome to another live stream. And today we are going to be playing. Uh, we're gonna try to recreate, I should say, based on the title, the 2004 Army Navy game. That because the last one occurred just yesterday. EA Sports. It's in the game. Utah Youth, baby. Here we go. It's in the game, baby. Go ball, baby. Purdue, baby. Texas, baby. We're in the school in Texas. It's all about that you, baby. You in the game, you in the game. NCAA Football 2005. There we go. I'll put this together. Actually select the screen. There we go. Profile. Name the school, which we're not going to be using today. There we go. Let's go right into play now. Oh, wait. Let's change the settings just a little bit. I'm going to try to not make it. There you go. Seven minutes. I'm going to make the game last not as long as the NFL games that we've that I've tried to do recently. There we go. Play now. Oh wait, I got it. That would mean I'd have to go through all that. No, I don't. Okay. Oh wait, yeah, I do. Just scroll through all these teams. Yeah, I just wanted to do one more PC stream before I went back into PlayStation streams. Hopefully tomorrow. We'll see. Because of the fact that the PlayStation 4 does not have any good college football games. Or even officially licensed college football games. There we are. Both decent teams back in 2004. Can I? Oh, no. I'm pretty sure both teams were option teams, so let's do it. Of course, I cannot perfectly recreate uh, yesterday's Army Navy game, which Army won that day 15 to nothing. Yesterday, 15 to nothing. Perhaps the purest from every the Army Navy game represents what's best about college football and amateur athletics, with a tradition that dates back to 1899. Every year, the cadets and the midshipmen meet in a game that embodies competition, pride, and commitment to service. So we're going to Lincoln Financial Field. Here's the call with. Here we go. At least, at least I hope. Uh, did the game freeze on the white screen again. Yeah, it did. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna try this again here. EA Sports. It's in the game. Let's give ahead. Sorry, folks, I did not mean for that to happen. We'll try one last time, and if it freezes again. Then, uh, if it freezes again, then we'll do the, try to do it at the replication of the, actual, try as best as we could to the actual game yesterday. There we go, let's start playing now. Let's see if this one loads up. If 
if it, yeah, if it freezes again, I'm just gonna. There we go. Down just a little bit. And here come the Black Knights. Hold on, is this gonna become laggy because of Okay. Hi I'm Brad Nessler along with Lee Corso and Kirk Curve Street. Today we got a battle for the Commander in Chiefs trophy. This recognizes gridiron supremacy. There we go, now we got it. Academy. The midshipmen are very confident coming into this one. They are definitely the favorites in my book, Kirk. Well, I think you're right about that, and I'll tell you why. Navy has outstanding leadership on defense, Hi. and it all starts with this young man. He gets his teammates lined up and ready to play every down. And Coach, he's got them ready to go for this one. Let me tell you why I agree with you. Army does not have the talent up front defensively to stop the running game. Kirk, the only way they have a chance to win this game is to force turnovers. Even then, I don't think it's going to be enough for them to win. Thanks, guys. Let's head down to the field. The two teams are lined up for the coin toss. Maybe he chooses heads. It's tails, so we'll defer. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I should have redid the title. We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. He kicks it. Hmm. Number eight takes it to 12. Okay, no. I can at least try to... No, let's skip. Let's go back. Let's try to... I can at least try to control the lag. By having it be a sunny day instead of a rainy day. And we'll... We'll do it at Army Stadium, which is a smaller stadium, so it should run a bit smoother. I do it from here. No, I got it. Oh, wait. It'd be under game modes. That'd be best. Okay. There we go. Uh, okay. I can't. Okay, I thought you could change the stadium. But apparently, it can't do that until later NCAA games. Hopefully, we could do it right and get it by, get it in a daylight setting this time. Hopefully this one won't freeze. It's another exciting contest to challenge football. There, at least it's not raining. And the temperatures drop below freezing for this night game between the Navy Midshipmen and the Army Black Knights. It'll at least make it more manageable. Right. And here come the Black Knights. Today, we got a battle for the Commander-in-Chief's Trophy. This recognizes gridiron supremacy among our nation's service academies. The midshipmen come into this game expecting a win. I tend to agree with that. How about you, Herbie? Well, I think you're right about that, and I agree with you. Thanks, guys. Yeah, we've already seen. This time, Navy wins the toss. And it pretty much goes the same way. They choose to receive... Uh, let's go this way. We'll see how this game plays out as they get ready for the opening kickoff. Kicks it off. There you go. And again, I'm sorry for all the lag you guys are probably going to see in today's game. Get past the tackler. They'll 
set up shot at the 25. Army brings in their nickel package. Here's the give. And they got him for a loss. So the Hold defensive on. lineman comes up with a big stop. Well, let's see if that works. Yeah. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on their own 22. Okay, that doesn't work. It's just... Army brings in the nickel here. Not doing it. There's a missed tackle. Brought down. Hold on, folks. Sorry to keep it like this. Let me just. Why does it always take so long just to. There. Third and ten. Ball on their own 25. I'll take it. At least it's a smoother stream. Or a smoother game for me. It's deflected. That'll bring up fourth down. Fourth down, and let me say one thing. This defense was up to the task that time in shutting down the pass play. Yeah, they shut it down. They got the three and out they were looking for. They send out the punting unit. Number 37 gets it off. Here we go. Number 29 signals for a fair catch. Yeah, I got a call for that one. Offense for the first time as they head out onto the field. As a coach, you love mismatches. In this case, if the slot guy is covered by the linebacker, you may have a nice play. Oh, turn it again. Setting up the play action. Looks. Watch the middle. The ball is hit. Thank, thank you. <laughs> and that one probably should have been picked off. Yeah, are you kidding me? There's a block. How long was that ball technically in the air? It had to be open. Everyone should know this one. Now go make it happen. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 36 yard line. And you know what, Kenny? Number 30 is a deep back as they line up in the eye. Man. Oh. Didn't think it would do that here. There we go. They go with the option. And now he pitches it. Well, at and least we got something. Four yards gain. Yes, hi. Gain let me tell you one thing. I'd keep the ball on the ground right here and let the kid fight for a first down. But you're telling me to run a pass play, coach. Army goes with the ace set here. They'll run the option. Oh, stumble for it. First down. On third down with the old option play. I let the dogs out. Time to have a little fun out there. Let's see if the old defense is ready for this one. Okay, coach. Ball in their own 47. Army comes to the line with three wide. They go with a toss. And he's going to throw to the quarterback. It worked. At least for a few yards. That's good enough. Some coaches don't like to run these types of plays. I'm sure they're happy to just get a few yards and that they didn't turn it over. As a coach, you love mismatch. In this case, if the slot guy is covered by the linebacker, you may have a nice play. Drop back to pass. Looking. Watch the middle. And that one's oh, where was that? A little too much juice on that one. Because this quarterback sometimes gets a little bit too excited back there and tries to put too much on it. You gotta relax and just make a good throw. What? So another third down upcoming for the offense. 
Number 30 lines up in the deep back. I formation. They go with Pull the back. And nope. they make the got shot. stuck in the line. Play, and they'll be short of the first. I think the offense thought they'd be able to get past this defense, but they were wrong. I just let the players go out there and have some fun here. It's fourth down. As I go to punt it away. Thank up. you, coach. See if this punk can go out of bounds. Looks like it's gonna. Number 33, field goal 19. And that's about as far as it got. So. Not a bad pin punt there. Spins up field. Nope. There. Nah, he needed more than luck there. That defense was tenacious. There we go. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on the 17. Second and 13. Got him. And he's tackled. Gain of a yard by the fullback. So that forces third and 12 for the Navy offense. Third down and 12. Ball on the 18. They come out with four lines. See if this works. He drops back. He's looking. Wants to throw outside. Brought down. No, nope, he out. caught it. Well, he down. It. The Titans usually are the most graceful players. Oh, no, field. he missed it. Man, I thought for sure he caught it before going out of bounds. Oh, well, that's good news for me. And they're ready to pump this one away. He gets it away. Number 29 takes it to 49. And now we'll see the offense come out oh, okay. of the field for their next possession. As a quarterback, you got to be aware of what the defense is throwing at you. Yeah, I remember Number that too. The deep back as they line up in the eye. They'll throw on first down, and it's knocked away. Guys, someone must have gotten a hand up there because that ball came out of there kind of funny. You bet. The quarterback let it fly, but it had no chance after that big tree got in the way. Second and ten. Ball on the 50. Number seven is back in the gun. Play action rolls to the left. Watch the and he dropped it. This incompletion is credited to the wideout. Absolutely. The quarterback executed his end of the deal. Let's go for the triple option again. Ball on the 50. Navy comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Now he pitches it. Got him. Oh. He's I think I'm going to be just short. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's going to be just short. Fourth down. Here's what I would do. I'd let the punter take the snap, roll out, and look downfield. He can either throw the ball or run with it if nobody's open. Let's go with the triple option. Well, apparently they think they can pick up the first here. Here's the option. And, he's and we did. Down. And that's a first down. Good game there by the fullback on this option play. You got to pound it and pound it inside until the defense calls for mercy here. First and ten. All right, so the cornerback's only going to be out for a quarter. Number seven has four receivers lined up here. They'll run the option. The lateral. He has some room. Tackle. And the option oh, works perfectly. Play. Just a simple option play here. The quarterback Lee gets Corso it up. is my hero. Great play. Boy, I tell you, this is impressive to see this offense when they're clicking. It's first and ten, and this is the sixth play of the drive. They line up in a double tight set. And on the first down. That was a pretty good run. Incredible effort there running the football by this guy. Right. 
Let's go the other side with this option play. For the first time today, we'll get to see how this defense responds when they're backed up into the red zone. Here's the option left, uh, and he stopped behind the line. Tried to pitch the ball, but he tackled me before I could get anything on that one. I'll tell you what, the quarterback has to be more decisive than that. Either get it to the back on the outside, or take the ball, find a seam, and <laughs> cut it upfield. Second and 11 coming up. Ball on the 15. Three wide outs right. here. Second and 11. Here's the option. And the fullback option worked. Play there. Here they give it to the fullback on the option, and the big guy gets good yards. Yep. Good yardage at a first down. Let's see if they can punch this one in. They're on the option. Got it. Didn't need to do much. They went for the blitz and it almost worked. Yard line. Everyone should know this one. Now go make it happen. Well, let's just do a straight up toss play. Long the 16. Number seven comes to the line with three wide. Pitch left. Shifty move there. Brought down. Seven yard run by the running back. Not bad. Good run there. Red zone trip resulted in a touchdown. I don't expect this one to be any different. Lateral's back. He might have a chance. And down uh, we go. Maybe I could have ran it in zone. First. In this situation, I challenge my offensive line to get enough of a push to give you a touchdown. in there for this goal line play. <laughs> Try to waste that clock. They go with the runner. Touchdown! What do you and say it worked. Touchdown, Army. A big fumble recovery got us a, another seven, another six points. You can find your tone thing even crossed the line there, but whatever. Left blew the whistle for the touchdown. Doing better than the real army. <laughs> we didn't watch yesterday's game. Army didn't score until the second quarter. And they didn't get the touchdown in until a big fourth down stop, which led to another touchdown eventually. But for now, it's 14 0 army. Navy, nothing. So it's second and ten. 
Ball on the 20. He'll get the call again. He's turned around. Brought down. And the pullback gains about four yards there. All right, here we go. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. Nickel defense. Option. No. Nope. Third down. There we go. They're pumped up. And they don't have a choice. They're going to have to pump this ball away. They line up to pump this one away. Didn't get all of that one. Number 29. Fields at the 50. Are we doing this? Are we doing this? We are. Touchdown. Army. Where was the coverage on that play? Well, credit to blocking here. They created a big enough lane for him to run through. And as they say, the rest is history. No. That's a way to start off the first, start off the second quarter. And he hits the PAT. And just like that, we beat the score of the real life. Well, I mean, he became yep, yesterday. Number three and number eight, deep to return. Which was an army victory of 15 to nothing. Kicks it off. You can see the difference of how we've played against how Navy's played. Yeah, someone give Coach the helmet quick. <laughs> Receiver there, coach. Yo, this kid needs to relax a little bit more. That ball's coming out a hundred miles an hour. You can't expect the receivers to get to that one. And they go. And they make it's the okay, stop. buddy. The fullback rumbles ahead for about a yard. Alright, so it's third and nine for Navy. <laughs> I think I saw yesterday that this was the hundred. Yesterday was the hundred twenty-first Army Navy game ever. We've made it like the fifth oldest rivalry in college football. There we go. Big first down. Well, interception, but still a big first down. Talking about this team being out of the football game. Uh -huh. To get back in the game, they need to start making some defensive stops and put some points on the board. That's okay. I need this big, uh, big win. <laughs> Excellent field position to start the drive. The Black Knights line up with four wideouts. Pitch right. They'll bring him down two yards on the toss play. Ah. Uh. In this situation, you got to trust the quarterback's decision-making. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 26-yard line. The Black Knights go with the eye formation. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, three, two, one. They'll run the option. He laterals the ball. He's into the open field. Brought down. The halfback option good for seven yards. Yeah, I know. Right, so you only got a few yards to go for the first, so you just need to rifle the ball in there. Third and one coming up on this play. Ball 19. This is how Army's done in the red zone. Another, Another two the for inside the 20. It resulted in a touchdown. 
Chapman. They go with the option. And now he pitches it. Shoves him away. Oh. And they make a stiff arm work, and that's enough for the first down. First down. Yeah, Brad, the tailback took the pitch and picked up a few yards there in the option. You just got to make sure that you're gaining positive yardage on a run because you're almost there. On the 12, and they can smell the goal line. Let's eat up the clock. Here's the call from the referee. Ooh. Mistimed it. Try to get it as close to zero as possible. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, with so many young guys out there, it's bound yeah. to happen occasionally. When you're in the red zone, it's harder to spread out the defense because there's not a lot of room. But depending on the play, you can find some holes in the deep. They're on the option. And he's going to lose yards on this one. So yeah, I right probably would have gotten get going. fumbled if I didn't, if I pitched the, the ball. Option game, but right now, there's nothing there. Good thing that wasn't a turnover. I thought he was going to pitch it. Yeah, see. It's second down and a long ways to go. Ball on the 18-yard line. Army comes out with an eye formation. One. They go with the option. Tackle. Two yards yeah, at no, the most. We're better off just keeping the ball and maybe pitching it out. I like this play right here, and I'm telling you why. It's a long yarded situation, and this pass play allows your players the ability to convert the first down. So another third down upcoming for the offense. What this Army team looks like. Both formation. teams are doing in real life is that they just waste that clock. Here's the option. He's got a lot of green. Oh, oh that was so close. Big game, but I don't think we're going to have enough. Nah. You better kick it here. Yeah, time to bring up the field goal unit. I can hold the kick now. <laughs> it's Is it good? And it's good. Yep. Time to take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summer. And remember the good folks at Pontiac have been bringing you fuel for the soul since 1926. Pontiac, the Army official vehicle the of the NCAA. And no, I'm not going to do Hail Marys. You only do that when you're behind. Number three, pass with the five. A little long uh -huh. the field. We'll Pretty sure that's a face mask, right? Holding. Oh, holding. That totally works out for us. First time. Grab him there. Those kind of families are the ones that drive coaches crazy and make them turn red. That's a 10-yard penalty that doesn't need to be committed. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Well, the left and end was down. able to Maybe get back up. Takes a time out. And that's the third injury of the game for Navy. Oh, no, wait, that's the second. First one didn't count because of the lag. And because of that, uh, Navy's going to take a timeout. Second and seven. Ball on the 14 yard line. The option. And they got, got him. Coming up on 
as well. Ball on the nine-yard line. Going to go down to a minute to go in the first half. I just broke that offensive lineman and got the quarterback for a loss. So that's going to... Let's just call timeout because they're going to punt it away. We could at least try to get some more points on the board. Already made him pay with a punt return earlier. Number 37 gets it off. Number 29. going to happen again. It could happen again. So nope. Offense, Down inside the, the 20. You know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. It's first and 10. Or inside okay, the number 20. 38 just dislocated his thumb. He'll be back. They go with the option. Oh. And he's going to lose yards on this one. Should have known and the controller would do that again. Well, nice but let's at least try to get... You can at least get three play. points. you got to go out there and compete. Be a competitor. Second and 11. Ball on the 18 yard line. Don't go the whole length this time. The kicker got them points on their last red zone visit. Let's see if the offense can get points this time. And they got him for a loss. The quarterback decided to pitch it on the option, but the back had nowhere to go. Just a perfect defensive scheme for stopping that. They got to the option before it got to the ah. third and 11 coming up here. Ball Let's just call a timeout and get our. Takes a timeout. This is why you have a kicker. Let's just there. get our extra three points. Ball on the 18 yard line. They'll call on the field goal unit here. The kick is up. Be good. And it's, and it's good. good. We're up 27 to nothing at the half. We lost a yard, but it's still got us three points thanks to the incredible return. Uh, here we go. And we even get the ball to start, start the second half. The second half. Up for the <laughs> Short kick. You didn't get a hold of that one. And you know what? Let's let it... Whoa! That was... That's quite a lucky field, bounce. Let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. No, lucky to get that ball back. And the fans have quieted down. Here's the draw. Well, at least all the Navy fans quieted down. You gotta pound it and pound it inside until the defense calls for mercy here. All right, coach. Right, let's. Second down and five. Ball on the 30. Slow it back down. This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Yeah, at least that's something. Here's number 30's play today. 77 yards on 14 attempts and two touchdowns. Everyone should know this one. Now go make it happen. Third and two coming up here. Ball on their own 33. The fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. And they'll run him again. There he goes. Breaks one. And he's tackled. What a run. Because that's how Army down. Navy games no, usually play in real life. Watch highlights of yesterday's game. You gotta be able to keep these drives alive. Like they did right there. You'll see, you'll rarely see the play clock more than five seconds. The key here is making sure. When they the finally snap the, the ball. <laughs> plenty of time to find the open receiver. Fans What's the point of doing a Hail Mary when I'm up by four scores? He drops back. 
He's in trouble. And the fact that Army in real life oh, barely throws the ball. That time, guys. Just let that one get away from his vision just for a split second. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 45 yard line. In real life, Army and Navy style of play is just keep and running. Fans have quieted down. A little misdirection. And down he goes. That's now 100 yards rushing on the day. Brad, that's just hard nose running, and it gives him another solid day at the ballpark. It's third down, and you got to convert. Just give the ball to your go-to guy. I mean, even when it's a passing down, even when it's a passing down, they will not, most 99% of the time, they will not pass the ball. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. This pace isn't exactly rocking right now. They go with the option. And they make the stop. A gain of a yard on the quarterback keeper. This is where you just go with what you know the best. As a coach, you got to do yeah, some different it away. to keep that defense guessing out there. The fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. Now... Number 27 boots it way up there. Number and it's going to be fair catched at around the 15 yard line. Yep. You know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. These fans aren't as rowdy as they were earlier, folks. Fifth tackle today for number 50. <laughs> Second down and 12. Ball on the 13 yard line. And the fans have quieted down. Here's the give. And he's oh, he stumbled forward for a few. Third and seven coming up here. Ball on the 18 yard line. This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Little handoff. And they got him. him in the backfield. That's going to bring up fourth down. Just a great job by the defense. These guys are disguising their defense so well that they're confusing the quarterback and the offensive line. All right, fourth and eight, and Navy's going to punt it away again. Back to receive, and you better believe this is the last guy they want to punt to. Number 37 gets it off. Number 29 fields it at the 48. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. I love a good draw play. you got the defense thinking pass. Navy with a total of one yard in today's game. So hey, maybe this is kind of reminiscent of real of yesterday's real game. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the twenty-eight yard line. The fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. All the Navy fans just went deaf. <laughs> or should I say mute? Five seconds. Here Here's the option, right side. Now he pitches it. Oh, look at that. And they make the stop. That's and we somehow got play. positive yardage out of that play. <laughs> Go. It's Let's run it up the left side now. Ball on the 24. These fans aren't as rowdy as they were earlier, folks. Here's the option. Elateral. 
Oh, 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 broken tackle, and push down. And he busts a big one on this defense. With his halfback is running the ball, I'd put a few more guys in the box there defensively to try to stop it. So yes, in real life, Army and Navy are option teams. Some more time. On the 12, and they can smell the goal line. They're in the red zone again, but this time they should be thinking touchdown. <laughs> Option to the right. Can you guys smell it? And he's tackled. And looks like the linebacker wasn't fooled on that option play. Maybe if I did it a second earlier, maybe we would have gotten something out of that. About 12 yards out. <laughs> and the fans have quieted down. Yes, Brad, the fans have quieted down. Could you stop mentioning that? <laughs> but the Navy fans have quieted down. I mean, you'd be quiet too if your team was losing 27 to nothing. And it worked. Touchdown, Army. Easy as uno, dos, tres. For you kids at home, that means one, two, three. As in three rushing touchdowns. In case you don't know basic kids. Spanish, here's Coach Corso to tell you about it. Right here. No need to go for two. Just kick the extra point. I know the ball technically crossed the plane, but why did he stop in the middle of the... Right, technically, before the end zone? This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Brad, we did it! Navy fans are quiet. It's 34 to nothing. You'd be quiet too. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Short kickoff. Number three deals in a third left. There we go. Okay. Okay. The okay. The 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 so get the ball here at the 27-yard line. The fans right, here we go. I can't blame them. On the ground, up the middle. <laughs> Brad, stop! And down. And the Is that what you're gonna mention every single play from now on? All the crowd's just not into it, and I don't blame them. Then stop mentioning it. All right, we'll make them go out to the fourth quarter. Two, one. That ends the third quarter. Unless we see some sort of miracle, this one's glad. I'm glad. Heading to the fourth. Our score: Army 34, Navy nothing. Now, where were the games like these back in 2004 when this game took place? Army didn't beat Navy from 2001 to 2015. They'll drop him for a loss. And only now and. Now they're in a hot streak. They've only lost two games in the past five years. No, wait, only they've only lost like one game. One, yeah, one game in the last five years. And the fans have quieted down. Yes, the fans have quieted down as they chant defense. Brad, this is a neutral side game. Half the fans are gonna be quiet. <laughs> And punt. Navy's gonna re realize now they, there's not much options left. No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number 37 gets it off. Number 29 fields it to 42. And we get it to the 45. Come out out of the field for their next possession. As a coach, you gotta be concerned with what the defense is throwing at you. Go with a read option. To take what the defense is giving you. This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Brad, stop! Down. Stop it! <laughs> and they pick up nine there. And, and you can you can see the big difference in terms of rushing yards. 182 to technically, Navy has no yards. 
absolutely nothing. Sure the offensive line gives the quarterback plenty of time to find the open receiver. The fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. <laughs> Brad, stop! If this wasn't a neutral side game, okay, maybe it is at least somewhat decent, but you don't have to say it every game. I'd sell the pass here, and then I'd hand it off to my halfback. First and ten, ball on the 40. These fans aren't as rowdy as they were earlier, folks. Keep it on the ground. <laughs> Big opening. Tackle. Quit that it. Nice Brad. Did a nice job of keeping his feet moving. Good solid run. As a quarterback, you got to be aware of what the defense is throwing at you. It's first and ten. Ball on the 25. And the fans have quieted down. What, Brad, no comment about the crowd this time? And he's tackled. And remember one thing that this coach said. They will force it down this defense's throat until they prove that they can stop it. When you can smell the end zone, you know you're right there. Now smelling it and tasting it are two different things. You, you got it? You be able to taste the end zone because it means six points. About 12 yards. You got it? There's a difference between smelling the end zone and tasting the end zone. This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Brad! Stop! They go with the option. Pitches back. Oh, what Little a move. Step. Brought down. Got it Nine close. Nine yards on the play. Nine yards gained on the play. I pitched it to my back and have him turn the corner. Remember, you only have to break the plane of the goal line to get six. Fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. <laughs> Stop it, Brad! Let's just punch it in. Touchdown. As a player, coach, you've got to be excited for a guy that's rushed for four touchdowns. But that offensive line's getting my pounds back. They've done a tremendous job on front. Absolutely right, Kirk. Yes, they You saw throughout the game, our uniforms got greener and greener. <laughs> They're not rowdy as they were earlier? No way! Let's just kick it up. Again, the Navy half of the fans go quiet, Brad. And they technically have positive yardage now. Second down and five. Ball on their own 25. This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Okay, I'm just going to ignore what Brad says about the crowd from now on. Because it's just going to keep repeating. Keep it on the ground with a tailback. It's a miracle, folks. Navy down. has a first down. First down for the 
running back. It's a big first down for this offense. Now maybe it'll take some of the pressure off the quarterback. Oh. It's first and ten. Ball on the 37. That's okay as long as it takes time off their clock. The fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. Here's the tip. Hmm. And they make the stop. Gain of a yard. You know, the more you run it, the more you're hurting yourselves. But I know there's nothing else you can do at this point, Navy. It's it's already over. As my defender just goes through two of my own. Two more. These fans aren't as rowdy as they were earlier, folks. He lost the oh. ball. And they fall on the loose ball. So they'll keep the They got it, but that's a big fumble. The coach is pumped up. See the loose ball and get on top of it. It's third down and 11 to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. And the fans have quieted down. Whatever. Back to pass. He's going right. Got him. At the point. And they tackle him. Uh, that's what I get for trying to get fancy and go for an interception. But in this case, you get a first down and then a bunch of yards on top of that. Ha! You're ecstatic. Yes, you're ecstatic, even though this game is 41 to nothing. This place isn't exactly rocking right now. Right. Minute 30 to go in the game. Alright. After that fumble, they've so gone the on a positive swing. The thing about the option is a defense, you have to account for everybody. Here, the offense gives it to the fullback, and he picks up the first down on a huge game. Here are the Old Spice EA players Sports of the game. Say congratulations to our players of the game. The fans are quiet, but I can't blame them. He drops back. Looking. He's under some heat. Short ball. And down he goes. And they get a few yards oh, nice. on that little reception. Check it out. He ran a good game on this play. And the timing of the pass was good. And they were able to get a nice game. These fans aren't as rowdy as they were earlier, folks. They go with the run. <laughs> And it's third down. That, 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 they don't care anymore. They may call a timeout and go for a field goal just to not get shut out. And the fans have quieted down. And they're not even going to call timeout. That's the game, folks. Army wins it. So this rivalry will have to wait another year to renew their acquaintances. Was this one any different than previous years? They talked about the rivalry all week long, and for good reason. We saw the intensity down in the field every play, and it showed us why these teams love to hate each other. It'll be interesting to see how this game carries over the next time they play. We here at EA Sports thank you for watching this game of NCAA Football 2005. The final count in this one, Army 41, Navy nothing. All righty. So that was a big win, and we changed history a bit. <laughs> oh. It's official, I'm a level 5 EA Sports game. <laughs>
Alright, what should we do? You know what, let's give this mascot game a try. I think this was the second year they had that. Let's go with what was then a... What would then be called a Mountain West game. UNLV versus Fresno State. I think this is the second year of the mascot. No, third year of the mascot game. So, what you're about to see may confuse you. Oh, better off keeping it yourself, man. Just as. Please don't. Nah, I think it. I think it froze. Darn it. Hmm. Uh, let's just do it from NCAA 2003. EA Sports. It's in the game. NCAA football 2003. Congrats, you folks just met the fans of uh, the University of Texas. Let's see if I can do- yep, here we are. Mascot game. The first year of the mascot game. So that means we get to play as every mascot that's in the NCAA game. <laughs> I can't get exactly that because I don't think there's any cow mascots in the NCAA. <laughs> At least in 2002. Closest one here is the, the Longhorn, Hook'em. I'm certain there's some in the, in the more recent, technically recent, NCAA games like 2013 or 14. Alright, we'll do Texas versus Virginia Tech, aka the Longhorns versus the Hokies. Let's load it up. I think I've seen it. Oh. You've seen a video where there's people in cow costumes fighting people in chicken costumes? Blackbird, Virginia and Lane Stadium, the place to be for what should be a great college football matchup. And there's a little chill in the air for today's game between the Texas Longhorns and Now watch this, guys. Check this out. Sports with my co-host Kirk Herbstreet and the coach Lee Corso. We hope you're as excited as we are for this one. Neither team seems to have an advantage in this game. Kirk, how about your prediction? You're right, and that's why I think individual performances will be the difference. Texas has voiced some concerns this week about protecting their quarterback. I think one of the best ways to slow down a pass rush is to hand the ball off to your talented running back. 
Watch for them to feed the ball to him and win a close game here. Let me tell you what I think here. Texas is in a whole lot of trouble here. I don't think they have what it takes to slow down this rushing attack. Their offense keeps this one close, but they lose this game because of their inability to stop the run, you guys. Thank you, guys. The team captains are on the field, and this game is about to get underway. All right, Texas chooses heads. It's tails, so let's kick it up. All right, let's kick it off. We'll see how this game plays out as they get ready for the opening kickoff. Kicks it off. Mm, nice long kick. There we go. Brady's and up. he'll He's take a knee to get a touchback. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. Texas lines up in a pro set. Go. Number 57 brings him down. Oh, besides, the all these players are perfect. Second down and five. Ball on the 25 yard line. Number 14 has four receivers lined up here. Number 14, steps back to pass, rifles it over the oh. ball. And the safety made a really My buddy, nice play this is the mascot game. This guy's got potential. 11 Hokies taking on 11 Longhorns. This is the first year of EA's mascot Long game. Horn. Come out in a 34 defense. Back to pass, looks. He rifles it to the left. He's hit and got away. Number 28 with a takedown at the 32. Talk there you go. Big first down. Uh, not this first down. Second and short, at I'm least. You, this thing is like a laser beam coming out of his hand. Boy, you're right. What a cannon this young man's got. The Longhorn. Line up in a 4 3. He drops back. He steps up, looking. He unloads it. Complete. He's at the 20. And down he goes. At the 17. There you go. Well, nice first down. That time with a heck of a throw. I like running here in this situation. It's a safer play. It's first and 10. They're inside the 20. Virginia Tech. Going with the power eye. Aren't all mascots, though? This is off the would be tackler. Number 28 brings him down at the two yard line. And the tailback picks up good. There you go. Got it all the way this down to the two. Very important. Listen up. If this defense cannot stop the running game, they're in big trouble. Maybe not here, but somewhere down the road. You gotta go out there and compete. Be a competitive. Let's see if they can take this one in for six. Drop back to pass. He lets it go. And it's caught. And it caught it. Touchdown. Nice little catch there by the fullback for the score. He sure did, and the receiver made one heck of a grab, too. All right, extra point time. And it's good. Extra point. Two minutes to play remaining here in the first quarter. Our score, Virginia Tech, seven. Texas, nothing. Virginia Tech, ready to kiss one off. Number 28 and number 87, back ready to return. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Not going to be enough to get it over the... Nope. Number 28 fields it in the end zone. In fact, before we start on the next play, check this out. Look. There's more of them. Look at all those Hokies. And you go right into the other side. And you see all the Longhorns. They'll go to work at the 20. Number 20. There's nowhere to hide from the mascots in this game. At the 23. And the quarterback, and the quarterback keeper quarterback only gets three yards three on that one. Second down and five. 
second down and seven to go. So we'll call it the Longhorns versus, I, I guess they're technically turkeys. Texas in a five wide set. Back to pass. Under pressure. Let's it go. Number and tipped away by the free safety. Great defensive effort that time. Did you see how that safety played that ball? That was a beautiful play. It's third down and seven to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. 4-3 defense. All right, third and seven. He drops back. He's under pressure. Number 19 with a catch. A and nice he gets knocked out of bounds. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his roof. You got to jam him at the line and throw their timing off. Texas in a four wide set. He's hit and got away. Number 42 there we go. with a takedown at the 38. A two-yard run by the halfback. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own 38. Texas goes with the ace set here. All right, second and eight. 2.22 to go in the first quarter. It's just right. Number 57 brings him down. Yeah, we at saw the one coming a mile away. away. Uh, it's third and six now. It's third down and six to go. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Texas comes out of the shotgun. Go pass. Nope. It's a run. Brought down. And the quarterback the gets it enough. And they get a nice gain on third down. Remember, we talked to the coach, and he mentioned that he wanted to run the ball against this defense. And he felt that he may have some success. Well, they've had some success on that play. It's first and ten. Ball right around midfield. The Longhorn come out the shotgun. There we go. Pass. Throws it out there. Complete. Ooh. He's at the forty. Number twenty-eight with a takedown at the twenty-nine. How about that reception? Yeah, like coach, not throw, too happy. Plus a nice catch and some good blocking equals to a chunk of yards. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. First and ten, ball on the 29-yard line. Texas sets up with four receivers. He passes it. And oh, number nine brings him down. At the I six. got it. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. Well, at least this is going to be a competitive game. I swear, I thought I. Cut the ball. They're crowding the line. Number 14, back to pass. Throws a lob pass out to the left. Nothing doing. Tackled for yeah, a Yeah, they the lost a yard on that pass play. Let's keep. Hey. <laughs> the Longhorn come out showing three wide. All right, here we go. Second and goal. Back to throw. Let's it fly. Ah. Makes a catch in the end zone. Didn't touchdown. do a good job defending the that receiver one. Receiver comes down with it for a touchdown. A real nice play there inside the ten yard line. Oh, nice. Tacks on the extra point. The down is just a few seconds left in the first quarter with a score. Texas 7, Virginia Tech 7. Texas is ready to kick it away. Number 87 and number 21. Back deep to go. return. Kicks it off. To the 8. Let's number see how far we can take this. Uh, we're going to get tackled anyway, but I think I pressed the wrong button. I like throwing a ball here. It makes the defense think they have to stop the run and or the pass. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 25. The Hokies set up in the gun. Back to pass. He's looking. He throws it. Number That's eight. okay. Makes a catch. Tackle. Just glad you hear it all. Good yardage that time on the pass. The thing that makes this play work is the quarterback. He throws this thing right in there. What an arm this quarterback's got. First and ten. Ball on the 44. Virginia Tech. Uh, we'll just let the clock run out in the first quarter. And we're all tied up at the end of the first quarter. 
We are ready to start quarter number two. The All right, switching sides. It's time to do that option Just play. Just turn the ball over on a careless pitch. Before I do, let me make sure. Oh no, wrong button. Let me just make sure I got it right. Okay. Z button's still the lateral. Number four on the option. The lateral. And he's tackled. Uh, the don't yard think line. I got anything. Back picks up a yard. I guess a yard. As a coach, you gotta be concerned with what the defense is throwing at you. I tell my quarterback to take what the defense is giving you. Second and nine, ball on the 45. The Longhorn. Line up with six defensive backs. He's looking for his man. They'll bring Found the open hole in the zone. A few yards that time on the pass. This is just a little pass to the halfback. Nothing spectacular, but it's plays like these that keep the defense off balance and drives alive. First and ten. Ball on the 41. Right, it's still 7-7. Seven, seven. The line of scrimmage. Just under four and a half four, minutes to go in the throw. second. Looks. He wants it all. Going long. Eh, and that threw too hard. Complete. It's the first incompletion all game for me. I like this play. Now you get the fullback into the passing game, and the defense has really got their hands full. Defense lines up. Eight men in the box. He fires left side. Ah. It away. Should have just waited until he was going upfield. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. That's a bunch of yards to go for a first down there. I just throw the ball down the field. Eh. Maybe you'll get lucky. Here we go. Virginia Tech comes out with an eye formation. Rolls to the right. He unloads it. Number 88. And it's wide open, it. and that's exactly what he did. <laughs> that third down conversion? Boy, what a play here, guys. I'm so really first pass to the right, it seems. Young quarterback. He was very cool and collected out there on that third and long play. I'd spread out the offense and let my quarterback zip the ball in there. I wasn't sure. You I'm not sure what they're chanting. chanting. Maybe the offense? Score. The Longhorn. Put four men up front. He drops back. Looking. He's rolling right. He's on the run. He lets it go. Complete. Number 90. With a I didn't expect him to run all the way back here after catching it. So that might have been a yard. Yep. When you're in the red zone, it's harder to spread out the defense because there's not a lot of room. But depending on the play, you can find some holes in the deep. Virginia Tech sets up in the eye. Number four drops back to pass. Let's it go. And it's yeah, not that was deserved. That one could have been an interception. Exactly. That's I'll take an incomplete. Go for a first down there. I just throw the ball down the field. Eh, maybe you'll get lucky. All right, three twenty-nine to go oh, in the Lord. second quarter. Bring in their dime package. Steps up in the pocket. Throws it out there. Ooh. Right down. Good call them throw to the right there. Gives them a first down well, that's enough for the first down for the Hokies. Knowing you can convert on third and long will open up your offense a little bit more on first and second. Let's see what they do from here. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Number four on the option. Oops. Gets past the tackler. And they push him out at the 12-yard line. He got knocked out there before because he EA could, up. man. Nice job again by the defense. Excellent pursuit angles. When you're this close to scoring a touchdown, I'm telling my guys to hold on to the football. Power eye set. Number 43 gets the carry. Oh, what a hit. The fullback gains about four yards there. <laughs> I know. In this situation, you got to throw the ball to your best receiver. Texas brings in the nickel here. There's a play fake. Now he's scrambling. He's looking. He passes it. And Touchdown. Touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? It's all about the receiver on this Took a lot longer than I wanted to, but still worked. <laughs> all he had to do after that was make the catch. That should have been blocked. And forced the fourth down where I had to go for the field goal. All right, good night. Ooh, almost got blocked. But that's no, but no, they missed. And that means that we get another point on the board. Is that one going to go over the field goal post? It does. We're watching him kick in practice all week, and I'll tell you what, he is for real. He definitely can kick at the next level. You better hurry. I need him on my fantasy team right now. Four man front by the defense. Okay, coach. Number 14, 
Oh, Bumble got it. And down he goes at the 16. What a play. The linebacker ends up with a fumble. Boy, that was a nice play. Couldn't have done that better myself, you guys. Let's look at that one. He didn't have a good handle on that ball. That allowed the middle linebacker to get the ball. I spread out the offense and let my quarterback zip the ball in there. You only need a few more yards for a score. The Longhorn put four men up front. And it's caught. And they make the stop at the 10-yard line. Six-yard pickup. When you're in the red zone, it's harder to spread out the defense because there's not a lot of room. But depending on the play, you can find some holes in the D. The Hokies come out of the power eye. Number four, steps back to pass. Oh, I thought I had Looks enough. Like he under threw that one a little bit. Kirk, I think he may have had a little miscommunication with the receiver on that one. Yeah, coach. It didn't look like they were on the same page at all there. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. Off to the right. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. 